Yo, so someone someone commented on my video, and they were like, "They're like, man, we need to stop this. Like, you know, like we we know we know this is getting old already. Well, for one thing, I know it's getting old. That's why the video is titled the biggest breakup. There's 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 literally not one video claiming that Elton Caste and Corey Shear is the biggest paranormal group to break up, and it proves me right." And if, the fact that someone doesn't even watch my video, clearly I, I talk about Corey in a positive way. Clearly the person didn't even watch my video. Might as well make this the intro. But anyways, though, my name is A1 Solution. Hopefully you have a great day. Uh, there was someone that commented and said, This is, this is, uh, this is, uh, I've heard this already, or not heard this already, but this is, this is boring, you know what I mean? This is getting old, but... At the end of the day, man, I'm just sharing my thoughts, and I truly think that they're the biggest group to, or paranormal group to break up. But at the end of the day, we're out here busting fuego, chew a bubble gum, kick a butt, save the day. Thank you to all the people that have commented down below in my video. I'm just gonna just, <laughs> I don't even know if I'm gonna add that. But anyways, though, uh, we have a Sam and Colby leaked Hell Week location, and uh, what I'm hearing from the podcast, uh, by the way, he, uh, Sam and Colby had a podcast with uh, Faze Rug. Um, I'm going to put the link down below. You can go check it out, uh, just in case if anyone doesn't follow Phase Rug or something like that. Uh, but they did uh, say that it might beat Conjuring. Um, the there was a Wiccan, um, some I don't know her name. There's a Wiccan that they brought for this uh, Hell Week trip, and she said that the Conjuring was a 7.5, and this school was like a 10 to 11 at a, or, or 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 seven out of out of 10. And uh, she was also saying, so the, so the Conjuring is a 7 out of 10. The, the school that they went to, they went to this place called Fair Elementary School. The school that they went to was, a, was like 11 out of 10. So she said that the school was creepy as crap. And the one thing that, Col that Sam said, he says that the Conjuring was already laid out. Like all the history is already laid out. We know everything about the Conjuring. But the thing about this school is we don't really know anything about this school. So... They they really do they they also say that this perspective like the story the format might be a little bit different from the Conjuring because the Conjuring I mean like everything's there like they said but this one they kind of learned it's gonna feel, it's probably gonna feel like the UK uh, Castle series in, in a way kind of not really probably a little bit less of that because obviously we knew the history there but more so I, I it's gonna feel like that kind of because i feel like we're gonna learn a couple things like his obviously history what's happened there stuff that we, we've never known uh also it's in it's it's gonna be in an iowa i believe iowa and they're gonna be there for a full week a whole entire week uh they also hinted um yeah i said this already but they also hinted that they're gonna it's gonna it might beat the conjuring it's possible and uh i think i think this was sam that said it, it was either sam or uh colby but they said uh, it's gonna run for its money, you know what I mean? Um, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna get up there. It's gonna be higher. It's gonna be high. It might get second, might get first. Who knows? That's why people are gonna let us know, I guess. Uh, and then uh, they also said, uh, I think Phase Rug said this. Phase Rug said, uh, can this video top The Conjuring? Uh, and then I wrote this. I was like, this is gonna be a dope series, man. This would be a great series because for one, it's gonna be Hell Week, so it's gonna be for Halloween. Uh, two, there's gonna be a lot of just production. They, they've been working on this for, you know, um, if you watch the podcast, they said that they worked on this for a while. They've been working on. I think they said they finished this about a week ago um, from that podcast, whenever the podcast was was made or, or yeah, made and all that stuff produced. Um, but uh, they also said plot plot twist wise, the story is already there. Um, oh yeah, I already talked about that. How the Conjuring, the story is already there. The the plot's already there. Um, but the school, no one really understands the history, and they want to share what they learned. Yeah, so that's pretty much what I wrote from that. Already talked about that. Uh, by the way, these are notes. I wrote these down as I was watching. Um, it's going to be an abandoned place for a week. They also slept on a floor. Um, blah, blah, blah. You know, obviously, it's, it's abandoned. You know, it's not going to be beautiful. It's not going to be like a giant mansion. Just, here you go. Here's this giant, beautiful place. Everything's clean. You got a janitor. No one goes to this school. You know what I mean? But yeah, so so they uh, they just talk about you know kind of like the conditions and stuff like that if it's like safe to be there or whatnot. Um, but they also say, I'm just gonna say it. So they leaked uh, exploring with Josh. I think he's I think they said that he's gonna be there for three days. So I'm gonna say it again because of speech impediment. But explore exploring with Josh. I'm gonna put his name up there. So 
is a, a speech impediment. But we also got Stern, Sterner, Sterner Roll triplets. I don't know who they are. Um, they must have done a series that I probably missed. Um, but they're like triplets. They're going to be joining. And then also uh, Selena, Spooky Boo, and Call Me Chris. And then they also have uh, another movie coming out. I don't understand what that means. I don't know what that means. I, I, I have no idea. They didn't go in depth with that. They were just like, yeah, there's four things dropping. They got the three episodes for the Hell Week. And then they also have uh, a movie dropping too as well. So I, I wonder what that's all about. But regardless of that, man, this this whole thing was about, you know, the, the location. Uh, the location was leaked. They've talked about it. It's not like, you know, like a hacker or something like that. This is literally like they talked about this. Um, this could be a school uh, called Fer- Fer- Feral. I'm going to screenshot it and show you. Uh, Feral Elementary School, and it's going to be in Iowa. And they've already filmed this. This is already just done. They just got to edit it and just kind of wait for, for Halloween and stuff like that. But I'm excited, man. I'm very, very excited. I'm going to leave the link to the podcast down below. So make sure you go check out the podcast. Go, they talk about a couple other things like, you know, going to jail and, you know, just a bunch of other things that they've done. I don't want to spoil it because then it's going to be like, why even watch the podcast? But I did want to talk about this because this is this was, to me, the most important thing um, that people want to know because not everyone's going to watch this podcast. And I feel like this is kind of like valid information that probably would uh, be kind of crispy to kind of um, consume, you know what I mean? And, you know, kind of yummy. But uh, regardless of that, um, go check out my last video. I talked about Elton Caste, Corey Shear, and the fact that they're the biggest, you know, paranormal group to ever, you know, depart, you know, break apart, you know what I mean, break up. Uh, I truly do. I feel that. And it's so funny how some people can be negative about that. Like, I'm being like, if you watch the video, by the way, if you should go watch the video, I'm literally positive. You know, I did show some screenshots like Reddit and stuff like that. But, you know. A lot of those things would be debunked. Why Corey was that way if Corey just defended himself and, you know, talked about his stuff that was happening. But at the end of the day, it's just funny to me that people would, you know, comment about that saying, like, are we going to move on? I'm bored of this. Like, at the end of the day, I'm sad, man. I've watched these people for seven plus years. And I'm editing my video here, too, by the way. But I've I've watched them for seven plus years. You bet you're done. You know, excuse my French. That's probably the first cussing word in this whole video. But... Bro, like, I'm a fan, man, and, you know, someone I looked up to that was inspirational, that I just enjoyed, I did hate it, I did hate the jokes a little bit, kind of wish we cut it down a little bit, I don't mind it, but I feel like it was kind of a, you know, just, I don't know, but at the end of the day, man, you know, I, I, I was peaceful in the video, I, I do want Corey to have a good time with his TikTok, I do want him to do well in his business with his candles, I do want him to succeed with his girlfriend, but, you know, like I said, you know, sometimes when you have a lot of conflict with the girlfriend, you break up, you come back together, you break up, you come back together, you know, there's some unhealthy things going on there. And I just don't want him to fall down and then end up not having anyone. That's also a thing. So I do care, okay? It's not that, I, I get it, some people are, that, that, it's only one person too, by the way. It's not everyone. It's one dude, one person. I'm not going to screenshot this person because they want to, they want to be, show, they want to be famous or something. I don't know. I don't know, but at the end of the day, man, my video was positive. I'm sad. Like, if you, if the person just watched the video, you could see, like, I, I'm sad. I mean, just staring at it, man, like, reading that this is the biggest break. It truly is, man. It truly is. There, there's just nothing like it. And the only thing that's, the only thing that can break that is, like, a Sam and Colby departure, you know what I mean? And that's not going to be for a while. They're pretty young, and I feel like they still got a lot of, a lot of just oomphs in them, you know what I mean? And uh, regardless of that, man, I appreciate every single person that checks out my videos. Today's video was a little bit more produced, right? Um, as I was watching, I wanted to add one more clip, but I just wish I did. But it was okay, though. It's not a big deal. But um, but it, it kind of is. I kind of wish I added it. But it's all right because, you know, I, uh, I, I, I had it all laid out already. It was already there, and I just edited it took a couple edits and did it done some some people liked it. A, a lot a few people good good, good good few people liked it man that's cool so regardless of that my name is a one solution have a great day this is anthony's one solution have a great day make sure you're chewing bubble gum and having a great day and we're out here kicking butt and having a great day and make sure you take care of yourself because my name is a one solution this is anthony's one solution we're out here busting flake chewing bubble gum kicking butt saving the day knowing is half the battle destiny is all say that six thousand times i can say it in my sleep i can say it in my sleep
This is Full Metal Jacket, baby. I go crazy and weep it and sleep it and and peep it. Believe it. Seeing is believing. I'm telling the truth anyways, though. Have a great day. I'm being dorky. I like being dorky because it shows how authentic I am. I don't really care what people think about what I do, guys. It's like go right in. Peace out. Anyways, though, have a great day. And stay hydrated. And stay safe and stay positive. Have a great day. And take care. Did it, beep, beep, beep. Later. <laughs> it's the fi- Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, by the way, before I go, uh, the the link for this podcast is going to be down below. It's going to be FaZe Rugs channel. Click it. Go check it out. And uh, have a great day.